Hello, my name is Laura Nicolás, and in this demo, I'm going to show you how you can onboard an Azure Arc Enable servers onto Azure Auto Manage. All of the automation and guidelines for the demo that you will see in this video are available on the Azure Arc Jumpstart. Check out the description box below for all the relevant links. For this demo, I have already created a resource group called Arc Auto Manage Demo, where I have an Azure Arc enabled server that we will onboard onto Azure Auto Manage. Azure Auto Manage is a service that simplifies the discovery, onboarding, and configuration of certain services in Azure that help with the operations of your virtual machines. These services are considered to be Azure Best Practices services and help enhance reliability, security, and management. As you can see, we don't have any Azure Virtual Machine or server that it's enabled onto Azure Auto Manage. So for this server called Arc Auto Manage, we will enable these services following CAF best practices. For this automation, we will use Cloud Shell, where we have all of the scripts and our templates that are required for this deployment. The first thing that we need to do is to provide and set the environment variables for our setup. We need to provide an Auto Manage account name, location, meaning the Azure region where our Azure Arc Enable resource is connected to, its resource group, and its machine name. Finally, we need to provide a profile name, meaning what kind of environment this Azure Arc Enable server is running on. It can be either production or dev test environment. Based on this profile, all of these services will be configured following Cloud Adoption Framework best practices. Once we are done providing and setting the deployment environment variables, we can save and close the editor. All we have to do now is run the shell script that will deploy two ARM templates for us. The first one is responsible for creating an Azure Auto Manage account and granting the proper permissions to it. The second ARM template will enable Azure Auto Manage on the Azure Arc Enabled server. Since this automation can take around 30 minutes to complete, I'm going to speed up the process for demo purposes. After the script has finished its run, you will have Azure Auto Manage enabled. To verify it, you can go back to Auto Manage Azure Machine Best Practices, and now you will see that the server is shown in the status configured. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to the channel and giving this video a like. Thank you and see you on the next one.